here with me, John. Today I'm going to be doing a special unboxing. This box I got right here. As you know, I've done a lot of ramen-based reviews lately, and a lot of those have been inspired by really one person on the internet. His name is Hans, the Ramen Raider, and everyone in the world has a special talent or special purpose, and his is to document every single flavor of ramen there ever was, meticulously even. Very high detailed photographs of, of uh, wrappers and containers and even the small packets that come within. He takes his time to do top ten lists every year of different countries and spice levels and it's a really interesting guy and a very informative website he has, ramenraider.com. Anyway, uh, kind of got to know him, talking to him online a little bit, and he uh, saw that uh, I was very much interested with all my videos that I've done, and he uh, reached out to me and asked if I'd be interested in getting some of his uh, extras. As you probably, if you're familiar with him, know he unboxes lots of ramen different places from all over the world send him ramen and he purchases a lot of them on his own as well and as you can imagine that creates a backlog of extras and there's not enough time in the world for one man to eat all those noodles so he wished me enjoyment of my noodles every day by sending me this box I don't know what's in it so let's go ahead and open it up well I know that it's ramens or noodles of some sort but uh, he did not tell me what he was sending just that he was sending it I think this has actually came in Mr. Mr. Handy it says probably uh, a box that was sent to him that he reused so recycling in action Let's see if I can get this. There's a, like eight layers of tape on top of here. Oh, still not open. There we go. Hopefully I didn't damage anything inside of there. I don't think so. Alright. What do we have here? Let's just go ahead and start. This is Little Couple's Q Noodle. There you go. Um, not a lot of this is in English. It says four, so it must be a four pack. Sauce packet, onion, canola oil, brewing soy sauce. I don't know. But it has a big Q on it. Two, uh, two little Asian women down there, anime style. But uh, looks good. And to that we have another one, another from Q. Little couples Q noodle. They both say 100% of something. Not sure what that something is. Um, watercress, orc extract. Interesting. I like the packages of these. They're like very square and compact. They have handles on them, so like you can like go shopping. Let's see what else we got here. This one is just loose. It says Mr. Noodle on it. There's something back there. Got a couple of these actually. This one is looks the same packaging, but the noodles of course look different. Looks like I got three, four of these style noodles, and one of these style noodles so far. Uh, what else we got in here? 
Yum Yum Green Curry flavor. Interesting. I've had some of the spicy curries from uh, Paldo and Bocamion, but I haven't had any like uh, regular curries that weren't trying to blow your face off with the spice. Oh, we got another one of the flatter style noodles. The, pal the uh, Samyang um, Carbo style. Yeah. He, he did tell me that these were going to be in the package. And I was like, hopefully you're not sending me any of the Carbos because I already purchased some of those and they're already on their way. And he's like, whoops. Well, got some more. I haven't tried them yet, so I don't know if that's a good thing or not. Ooh, these look interesting. We've got UFO. These are both UFO. And we have fried ramen Japanese sauce flavor. And we have UFO fried ramen flaming hot seafood flavor. They both have the turbo drain system. So you can drain it in uh, turbo speed, I guess. Excellent. And then we have Korean Gamtang. It's the same Samyang. Samyang, uh, of course, makes the the Fire Noodle Challenge Pokemon noodles. Korean Gamtang, cream style noodles. Hmm. Looks like it has beef, beef flavor. There's beef on the front. beef extract. Interesting. Well, I'm definitely going to have to ask him about these guys because they're kind of like naked. It says Mr. Noodle on there. Uh, maybe I can look at Mr. Noodle. It also says K Food. I wonder if that's like a grocery store that it's sold at. Interesting. And then we have a few little extra things he sent me. Starting with this, we have hot chicken flavored almonds from Samyang. So I wonder how uh, how close they'll taste to the Bokemian noodles, how spicy these will be. Interesting. My wife will probably like these too. She loves almonds. What else we got? We have two cup noodles stickers I think yeah they're definitely stickers I think they're just one use stickers so I'm not going to try to take off these but uh, they feel like they're pretty like high quality like they're not uh, paper like more like photo paper that kind of thickness to them and what else we got this Mr. Noodles bag Mr. Noodle Got some uh, codes on the side of there. I don't know what those are for. One says line. Mr. Noodle. Which are these things. These are Mr. Noodle. So perhaps these barcodes will help me decipher what these are and how to make them. Awesome. I'll put this in with uh, all my other bags I have too. Cool, cool, cool. I wonder where I'll put these. More, much more than a soup. And this, this is just a regular cup of noodle. This says very veggie chicken flavor, which I know is one of Han's favorite ones, or one of the ones that he was very impressed with at least. Wow. Well, all these noodles in front of me and all this. I'm going to enjoy these noodles and maybe not every day, but for a long period of time and a lot of days. Uh, I also have my own box of noodles that I have to work through. But I'm not going to complain because these are like free lunches. Anyway, thanks for watching the video. Um, 
if you haven't already, go check out the Ramen Raider. He has a YouTube channel where he does unboxings like this, and he also does uh, reviews um, of new ramen and challenges himself to taste some of the hotter ones, including the Prohibited 18, which kind of uh, killed me, and it killed him twice, and I think he's going to actually try it again. Um, not sure how soon, but, uh, ugh, I don't envy that. Anyway, thanks for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and until next time, bye-bye.